here we go, inspired by April Wilkerson, which was inspired by somebody else, and I can't remember who it was, but here it is. It's 18 inches by 18 inches by around six feet tall, and it is the rollout tool chest. So these are the tools that I use for 70% of what's in there is used on just about every project that we do. My worthy assistant, Dylan, is gonna open the measurement panel. The measure, that is not a measurement panel. The panel right behind you, that this one. one. Oh. Yes, well, oh. well done, young man. So hearing protection, goggles, hammer, chisel screwdrivers, lots of tape measures. That shelf is kind of unfinished, but um, it's fine. And then flip out the thing there, the, uh, or the, right below the flip box. There it is. Gloves and dust mask and hearing protection, etc. And then under that we have a drawer. That's a very short drawer, but it also just pops right out. And that is for those things that I hate to see when they're hanging. They, like pliers, always seem to fall off the hanging type of uh, storage. So I like this a lot better. And that's one drawer. And then we have two different circular saws, and then the basically a heat gun blow dryer and iron for edge banding. Up here we have miscellaneous measuring devices, Craig, um, the width measuring things, the Craig adjustable shelf jig is in that case on the right, screws, uh, driver bits, that kind of thing, drill storage, bows, must have the bows boom box in the garage, and then we have this, I love this drawer. This is maybe my favorite door in the whole thing. Yes, all the screw bits, all the screws, and all those kind of things that we use a lot, drivers. And then the next one is the little uh, calipers and those kind of things. And as we go down, other stuff that's used a lot, battery storage, got a um, power strip back there, glue and paste wax, the saw storage so I don't get cut up by it couple of planes and then today the end of the project was the drawer the last three drawers that we put in there for saw blade storage and miscellaneous weird stuff and brushes and whatever else flashlights etc so there it is just about everything that we use over and over again all in one place shuts down to an 18 by 18 box and if you shut it and put it right next to the hardware storage cart that's a lot of stuff in the space of three feet by a foot and a half and it looks very nice and neat except for when Dylan's waiting to get the cord out of the way yeah. so smooth so smooth and there it is good stuff thanks for the inspiration April